The royal wedding took place last month, seeing Prince Harry and Meghan Markle tie the knot in one of most star-studded and touching ceremonies of all time. Since the nuptials, the whole world has been obsessing over the official royal wedding photographs, and it seems no one is exempt, with even the Queen getting in on the Hagen love. Although she may have looked remarkably stone-faced throughout the ceremony, it seems Queen Liz has a soft spot for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, especially after new photographic evidence. In a photo call at Buckingham Palace last week, photographers were invited into the Queen's audience room, with one furnishing gaining particular interest, a never-before-seen framed portrait of the newlyweds. The public took the typical proud grandma move as a sign of the Queen's approval of Meghan. There was surprise therefore when at another photo call this week seeing the Queen meet composer Thea Musgrove, the photo of Harry and Meghan was nowhere to be seen. In its place was a framed photo of her grandsons, Princes William and Harry, with the removal sparking concern from royal fans. Luckily, it seems that there's nothing to worry about with Queen Elizabeth reportedly moving her photographs around regularly. So, Meghan and Harry should be back in their spot in no time. The portrait of Harry and Meghan, taken by the couple's wedding photographer Alexei Lubomirsky as part of their engagement shoot in December, showed them in a loving embrace and was previously seen on the right side of the fireplace. It was the first photo of the Duchess of Sussex to appear in Buckingham Palace and was next to the Queen's other treasured pictures of her grandchildren and great-grandchildren. The audience room, situated on Buckingham Palace's first floor, is filled with photographs of the royal family and provides fans with a rare glimpse into the Queen's personal life.